This is a second method of removing a stuck spent mandrel or broken off pop rivet from inside your pop riveter. So typically if you would have your drill in reverse to try and eject the mandrel, it will not come out in the front. So to remedy this is just remove your riveter from the drill, take your wrench, remove the nose piece and after that remove the nose cover and there you can see the pop rivet is stuck inside the jaws. Take a wrench, remove your pop rivet chamber by just turning it anti-clockwise and that will release the tension on the jaws. There you can see the jaws on the inside. That will release the tension on the jaws. Take your broken mandrel out. Alright, so just before you put your rivet chamber back, just ensure that the jaws are still properly aligned. Then simply screw this back onto the riveter. Take your wrench, it's got two little notches in there, just tighten it, Don't, do not over tighten. Take your nose piece cover, screw that back on and that you can just tighten by hand and then just give your shank a couple of turns clockwise to release the pressure on the nose piece, insert the nose piece, tighten with your wrench, put your drill riveter back into the drill, and drill in reverse until your rivet chamber comes forward, you hear the clicking sound, insert the pop rivet, Drill in forward motion, start riveting, drill in reverse, and your mandrel will eject again. And that is how you fix a broken spent mandrel on the TC Rev 001.